Hey everyone, welcome back to How Tech. Today we're going to show you how to set up a Wi-Fi hotspot on an iPhone 12 Pro Max. Actually, this should be the same for the non-Max or even the non-Pro version or anything running iOS 14 should be pretty similar. Uh, the other important uh, disclaimer is that whether or not you can turn on a, a hotspot is actually dependent on your SIM card or basically your carrier settings. So I'm going to show you that uh, this particular phone is also a dual SIM card phone, so um, yours might be different if you don't have dual SIM. But anyway, let's just show you. So first of all, to activate this guy, just go to the settings menu, and you can actually already see here, personal hotspot shows up as an option. And that is very important, because if your phone doesn't show this, it might be because your plan does not allow it. And let me just prove to you that, at least in this case, on my dual SIM one, I can actually turn this on and off. So I have two SIMs here, uh, one that allows me to use a, SIM, a hotspot and the other one that doesn't. So right now I have my cellular data set to primary, which is this one. I'm going to switch it to my other one. And as it's searching for the thing, you'll be able to see this disappear. So yeah, it's real. It's true. I'm not making this up. Some people don't believe me. Uh, but basically, that's how you turn off the uh, idea of a hotspot is if your card doesn't allow you to. So you can see here, hotspot showed up there before too. It's not there anymore. So let me switch my data plan back to my Hong Kong number. And three, two, one, give it some time there. Personal hotspot's back here, and it's also back here. So basically, I can now turn it on and off at either of those two. It actually goes to the same menu. So now I can turn this on and off. Do I want people to join it? Yes. Uh, the password, this is the default. You obviously want to pick something probably easier to tell or too easier to type. Um, the other thing to keep in mind is that this phone can do different kinds of, in this case, tethering. You can connect it via a cable to, let's say you wanted to do Wi-Fi sharing with your, or in this case, network internet connection sharing with like a laptop. You could actually plug it in through the cable. You could do it through Bluetooth or you can do it through a Wi-Fi hotspot. So basically, allow others to join, activates that, Here's your password, you can change it. Uh, and then also you have one other option, maximize compatibility. So this is, I guess, like setting the lower speed, more universal, like 802.11.b instead of g or something like that. So, so I guess if you're having a problem connecting, maybe turn it off or on, but otherwise just leave it. Uh, so yeah, that's basically the standard way of turning it on and off. So let's just see that's on now, I can turn it off. If it's actually connected, just keep in mind that the little clock thing has a blue background. That's so you know that something's connected to it. Uh, the other way to activate it and deactivate it faster is if you pull down the shortcuts menu from the top right, just pull down. You can see, first of all, turning on and off Wi-Fi here. That's not the hotspot, though. To get to the hotspot, push on this guy, and you can see that now I have some extra options. Same things like the airplane mode and Wi-Fi on and off, but you can also do personal hotspot, whether you want it to be discoverable or not discoverable. So now it's on and uh, nothing else shows up here, but basically once something's connected, this will also turn blue or yeah, just go in and you gotta push and turn it off. And also keep in mind that obviously if you're in airplane mode, I believe it turns itself off as well. Yeah, so airplane mode kills everything, but you can turn this guy on, but I don't believe you can turn this guy on because there's no point in making a hotspot if you don't have uh, like a cellular connection. So as long as this one's off, this should be off as well. It's like, can't be turned on. There we go. So anyway, let's turn that off. So that's basically it for two different ways of switching it on and off and also obviously setting it up. And of course, keep in mind that if your SIM card doesn't allow it, you're SOL. Okay, so that's it for today. If you have any questions or comments, uh, did I get anything wrong? Please let me know in the comments below. And if this video helped you out, give us a thumbs up. Okay, thanks. Bye. Everyone, welcome back to How Tech. Today we have an iPhone 12 Pro, hot off the presses. I just picked it up at the Apple Store. It is the morning of the release, the 23rd of October.